Well, after a record year of use for the Bemidji Parks, city staff is hoping to develop a plan of action to help better facilitate and accommodate everyone's needs. A focus group made up of organizations and key stakeholders that use the parks met this afternoon to discuss the future of the parks and trail system. The park with the most use is Paul Bunyan Park, with large events like the Water Carnival, the Dragon Boat Festival, and the Mississippi Music Festival. The discussion also focused around many of the smaller charitable events that use the space. What we're trying to look at is how can we better partner in the community to provide recreation programming and services um, to the, our participants? Who can we best work with and how we can improve our relationships with all the many organizations that we already work with um, and strengthen both their role and our role in the community? Is the goal of today's meeting was to create a better understanding of what is needed to make all events that use the park successful. All the information collected from the group will be used to help develop a long-term plan of action for the Parks and Recreation Department. The next step would be to present kind of our findings to Parks and Trails and the Council and establish um, a plan of action of things that we can do that will get us where we need to be. The plan of action for the park system should be completed by spring of 2018. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.